What's up, everybody? It's DJ Big Dad. Apologies, we're not really going to be using the microphone a whole bunch today, but uh, I do want to explain um, this new setup that I got going and how everything is working. So, I have a loopback as a plug-in or application that you can get on your Mac or on, apparently on your Windows too. Um, but anyway, you can set up a uh, essentially all the programs that you want to loop through um, this sound device, right? They make it just so much easier. So shout out to them. Um, I unmute my audio devices and that way it just comes through naturally, right? Um, I've got the things that I want to record or have running through the sound that is then running through. Right now I'm using QuickTime to do my recording. So yeah, um, first steps first, uh, I'm about to use Reasons, this application right here, to essentially make a beat. And being that all of these sounds are running through, you can see that I can even commentary, throw down a bone, and still be able to talk about what I want to do, and yeah, it's pretty great. So give it a go if you're wanting to get into broadcasting and recording, it really does help out the process. Okay. So let's get back to reasons here. I'm about to make a beat. Let's say I was I was on the internet earlier, right? I, I got ahead of myself a little bit, but I wanted to explain this to you guys. So I have an iPad with a plugin or a program or an application, whatever you want to call it, called Pianist Pro. And Pianist Pro essentially has its settings you go into the settings and check it out. It's the settings. Excuse me, I'm trying to find it. Okay. So there's a MIDI button in the top right hand corner. You hit MIDI. And you make sure that you have your MIDI in, MIDI out, going through a network interface. And essentially the OSC connection. Is set to 192.168.0.1 and the port is 5004. So then I come up here, I click on create a network, create a network, it doesn't matter what the name is, I just got to remember it on my iPad. So I go over to my iPad, I hit settings, and I find my network, which is Sean's MacBook Pro. I have it selected now. I make sure Pianist Pro is closed before I uh, do this next step. So it's closed, then I come down and I find, uh, if you don't have this in your taskbar, I would put it in your taskbar, you can find it by going command spacebar and typing in, um, apparently my Siri is not available, I have turned her off. So it's in applications, and it's under utilities. And then it's in here, uh, audio MIDI setup, so I keep mine down here, audio MIDI setup, I do show MIDI window, close that other one, ignore that, this has been kind of a pain in the butt recently with the new thing, anyway you go to network, and then you start a session, right, and you make sure the port number was the same as what's on your iPad, Make sure it's enabled, right? Then once you open up Pianist Pro, you can see that my iPad came in. And it is connected. So now you can see when I play a note, it's coming in with low latency there. Because I am created my own network and nothing else is traveling through the network. So that's super low latency, guys. Three milliseconds is amazing, right? Okay. So if I get a a warning or a bug, it's a there's a bug that's been going around on. Uh, well, that's not what I want. There's a bug that's been going around on High Sierra right now. That when you close this application, it sometimes freaks out. But straight up, that's a bug on the good old Mac world, right? So let's go ahead, open up Reasons. Check out where our sound's going, because that's always the first thing I do. So right now it says no sound, right? So I want to change that, obviously, um, to my main audio sound. So 
uh, Studio Anything is what I called it, and you should be able we should be able to get a new one going. I'm gonna open up one that I already have just to make sure it's working right. Let's see. Let's see if this one's ready. Be all right. So right now I'm not hearing it. But it does appear that there is an input. So let's check our sound again. We have could monitor through that. Or, I think if I remember right, I need to just change this to output. Let's try it again. There we go. Now I can hear it. And it should be feeding through to your guys' end as well, because I've already tested this. Alright everybody, so you can see now what we're about to get into, right? All right, so yeah, that was just a little beat I threw together the other day, and thought I'd take a listen real quick. Let's let's try this one. All right, this is a good one. But you can see the benefits of doing this now. Now I can actually showcase my stuff um, online. The problem with all of this is. I'm not connected to the internet, so right now I'm connected to my network, right? That does cause an issue in my book if I want to live stream. But it's okay because this works just as fun. Big Dad.